Hello everybody, this is your global warming skeptic here, out with a quick video just to debunk another idiotic liberal lie. Now there's this thing going around the internet rumor mill that there's a study by the CDC that says that um, black fathers are suddenly involved in their children's lives. Now, I'm at the CDC website, and I don't know how the CDC works, I don't know it's publishing things, I don't even know where the media is getting this, but here's the CDC front page, and you'd figure such a study would be on their front page. Let's go to their main page. Well, first of all, let me show you, it's not on here. Thyrotoxicosis, cigarette smoking oral contraceptive doesn't look like it's on here let's see epidemic measles okay let's go to the regular CDC let's just cover all our bases I'm doing this live of course now as you can see there's nothing relating to such a study giving the media the benefit of the doubt it could be that the study is finished but it's not published anywhere yet such as like a peer review paper but like I said I don't know how the CDC works so we're not going to get into that but we are going to get into the data that is available that is clear right here we're going to go into um, blacks and how their fathers are involved in their lives as reported by the US Census Bureau data that we already have so let's look at this okay now let's get some baseline here okay 2009 total the percentage of people living with either two parents or or their father as a single parent is about 68.6 plus 3.7 if you can't see it, it's 3.7 68.6 so a little over 70 percent there's your baseline um, for white alone you got um, two parents 74.7 um, father only 3.6 you got about over 80 percent 80.3 percent so let's go down here now now this is where this stuff is debunked um, so you got black parents you got two parents 36.6 percent father only 4.3 so that's about 41 percent that's f almost 40 points below where the whites are and now we got the Hispanics um, you got 67.4 and 3.0 so that's about 70.4 they're around the national average so what do you take from this well nothing that the CDC posts is going to change anything because here's the thing you know if the black father is involved I accept that they are just as involved if not more because it's going to come from middle class wealthier families and another thing this isn't me saying you know people you know it's because they're black that they're just abandoning their children no it's it's quite a number of things it's gang culture it's urbanization it's liberals isolating these people and making the fathers want to be out for themselves because there's a culture of hopelessness inside of the large cities you know, it is hopeless their infrastructure is crumbling their police structures crumbling the gangs are out of control so what do you get you get people who are out for themselves 
no hospitality, no responsibility except for survive. That's what I'd attribute this to. But here's the thing. You know, whatever you want to pin this down on, you don't say that something that is a problem is a non-problem. I'm sorry. We have data already. Nothing the CDC is going to post is going to change what the data says. So, this is a recurring theme on my channel. If you want to come up with solutions, you cannot tell lies or distort or misrepresent data. That's the bottom line. Thanks for listening. God bless.